Uh, we play you know, for five minutes and people get pretty uh, sweaty, pretty tired. It's kind of like soccer, but once you're inside a bubble, all the strategy that you have normally for soccer is pretty much out the window because no matter how big or small you are, the bubble pretty much democratizes everybody and you can knock anybody over no matter you know, what size or your athletic skill is. How do you practice for a game like this? Um, I roll down the hill and try to get up really fast a few times over there. So if I fall down, I can get up really fast. I'm really just running into people as much as I can. No real strategy other than that, just knocking people over. How's it feel to score that first goal? Oh, it's a dream come true. <laughs> We've been getting requests for bubble soccer for years now. This is something our members have been asking for for quite a while, and we finally made it happen. And so that's my guess is why it'll catch on. I mean, you see this all over the internet all the time. People are wanting to try it. So um, if you give people the opportunity, they're definitely going to come out. Yeah, it was really fun. I don't know, someone helped me. <laughs> someone pushed me again. <laughs> Yeah, it was really fun. <laughs> I, I think someone pushed me again and then I figured it out, I don't know. <laughs> I just didn't know what was going on. <laughs> and to see also, like you can't really see the ball where you're going and suddenly someone pushes you on your back and you're like, oh my god. <laughs> but it's fun. A lot of people just still don't know about the sport and it's so much fun. So we wanted to come out here, just a random flash experience day, just get as many people as we could and hang out on a summer day and play some ball. How was it out there? Oh, it was, it was treacherous. I mean, it was like it was like World Cup all over again, only less grace.